Depois de terem sofrido com o pessimismo do mercado no início do ano, os países emergentes têm vivido um forte rally desde março. Como podemos avaliar esse movimento e quais são as apostas para esses países? Segundo Benoit Anne, chefe de estratégia para mercados emergentes do Banco Societe Generale, apesar dos fundamentos econômicos em alguns desses países não serem tão fortes, é preciso observar também outros fatores na hora de investir nos emergentes. Is as bad as we experienced in 2013. There's better visibility on the Fed policy front, mm -hmm. and there are better valuations, better technicals right now supporting emerging markets. So I don't think emerging markets as a whole are as vulnerable as they were last year. Mm -hmm. And are they expected to, to present more growth you know, next year? Hopefully, yes. The global growth picture will improve, including in emerging markets, and that is going to be also supportive. Mm -hmm. And about, about Brazil specifically, which changes are necessary for Brazil not being the most vulnerable countries next year? We need big structural reform plans. We need uh, stronger investor confidence. Uh, a lot of things to be done, really, uh, to address the structural bottlenecks. When you look at the fundamentals in Brazil, uh, the picture is not particularly good. High inflation, low growth. A lot of that is caused by structural uh, weaknesses. So those weaknesses need to be addressed. To him. And if we stand in the same path, what will happen? Well, Brazil will be uh, placed on the list of countries to avoid uh, at times of risk aversion, which might pop up next year, uh, so that will not be a good thing for Brazil. So I would like to ask you for a trade recommendation from, for emerging markets. My big trade recommendation would be to buy local currency bonds, especially in those markets that provide high yields. My top picks are South Africa, Mexico and Hungary. I'm going to avoid the countries subject to geopolitical risks and Russia comes to my mind in the, uh, at this juncture, I'm bearish on the ruble for that particular reason. Mm -hmm.